No secondhand smoke is bad for you. Suck on this! Trash this city. All the people are walking hunched over and nervous looking. Now that's how martial law works. You control the city and the people by breaking the boat down first. Yeah, well, occupying armies suck. You may want to keep that to yourself. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Look out below! Not <laughs> bad, huh? Oh, you wanna see it again? DUP guys are in this city. Yeah, well, luckily you have the advantage in numbers, my man. Uh, how do you figure that? Well, because one person can move around faster, lighter, quieter. Plus, it'll make them underestimate you. Not gonna know what hit them. You wanna do me a favor and explain that to them, so maybe they'll just give up? Why? Spoil the surprise when it happens. <laughs> Good point. Checkpoints and cameras on just about every corner. That's the benefit of having home field advantage. Except this isn't their home field. Try telling them that. Oh! Hell yeah!
Okay, so that way is not an option. This better work. That was awesome! It freaking worked! Reggie, I've used up all the core relays you sent, man. Come on, any more! No, man, that's all you get. This bioterrorist thing has you all worked up. You, you need to find some place to lay low and chill out for a while. What is it with you and laying low? I'm fine. I'm great. Give me more. No. Now, I'm working on a possible lead with a detective on the SPD, but we're not moving forward until I'm convinced your head's on straight. Okay, okay, I'll lay low. Whatever the hell that means. Nelson, I've got some information on the DUP's communications network. And there's a central antenna so they can coordinate the movements of all the smaller districts. Alright, any idea where this central communication thing is? Well, you did say you wanted to see it while you were here. Shut up, Space Needle? Space Needle. Okay, Reg, I'm here, and you were right. The needle's tricked out with all kinds of electrical crap and what looks like a bad aluminum siding job. You're gonna have to get to the top of the needle. It's a nice day. I'll just climb to the top. Climb. No, no, no. Don't be crazy. Right, hey, man, it's not crazy to be awesome. <laughs> hey, Reg, hypothetical you know, theoretical, totally what-if question here, but what would be the explanation for how I might be able to draw the power from some conduits, say, oh, I don't know, Hank, and not others, like one of these dupe troopers? Oh my god, so you did try earlier. Hey, I'm not looking for an I told you so here, Reg. I'm just looking for an answer. The dupes had those things locked down. Well, I suppose that hypothetically, theoretically, it could be you can only drain powers from a conduit who has them naturally. A prime conduit, like Hank, or hopefully Augustine. I mean, the DUP guys got all their weaker powers from Augustine, so maybe they can't pass them on, even to you. So you're saying this stuff's even uglier from the inside. Looking forward to taking this stuff down. Nelson Rowe, you hung up on me before. Sorry, Betty, but uh... Don't tell me this is a bad time to... Actually, at the moment, I'm <laughs> kind of climbing up the outside of the Space Needle. Well, if you don't want to talk to me, just say so. Gonna have to call you back, Betty. Okay, not a good time to plummet. Aren't you a sight? This is more like it. I'm on the uh, observation deck. Uh, don't let your guard down. Uh. Yeah, you know what they say about secondhand smoke. Onward and upward. Going. You're almost to the top. Alright, time to gouge out the eye of the needle. And that must be what holds it all together. What the hell? Oh, I haven't seen you before. Rex, man, they got a small army up here. Good. They're in the right place. 
or that they really don't like other people playing with their stuff. On focus, Delson. Do you see any way to take down the communications? Yeah, yeah, there's this uh, anchor. Looks like it's holding all the antennas in place. I don't think this is gonna cut it. Nothing bad ever came from getting new powers. Oh, this is going to be epic! Subtleties for losers. What a rush! I hope Reggie's got a good view of this. It goes away. Hello, Science Center District. I lost you. Did you read me? I'm getting nothing, sir. You? Nothing outside our immediate area. Find us some prime conduits and get some new powers. We own the streets! Take it easy. A few streets in the immediate vicinity, all right? The DUP still owns the other 98%. But we kicked them off the Space Needle, man! You knocked out their comm center, okay? They may be deaf, but they're not dumb. Kicking the DUP completely out of Seattle is gonna take time. We just got here. You know what they say. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single kick-ass tag. Who says that? The Chinese people. Hey, Reg. You see it from down there? <laughs> Are you kidding? People in Portland can see it. I just want to let the dupes know I'm here, man. Who the hell is that? That's not one of the three who escaped. What's the symbol supposed to mean? Not sure. The banner man got away before the dupe reinforcement. Delson, I've been asking around about the escaped bioterrorists. Do you think I maybe need like a PR guy? What, what the hell are you talking about? Uh, people here are starting to call me the banner man, which A, is unbelievably lame. Uh, maybe not the best idea, you hanging around the Space Needle right now? Well, I mean, why not Smoke-tastic man, or, or hell, just the smoker? Look. I'll keep trying to get a lead on the escape bioterrorists. Why don't you see if you can disrupt other DUP operations around there until I get back to you? 